As Louisville prepares for spring, the city cleans the sidewalks and streets to make sure they are looking their best. In the past, that has meant clearing out homeless encampments. But today, as Rose McBride shows us, they took a different approach. Public Works came down Jackson Street and cleaned the sidewalks and streets. But the goal is not a clear out, just a clean up. You can lose your homes just like that. Just, just like the rest of these people do. Bobby Mercer has been living in an encampment like this one on and off for 15 years. He's been there when the city has cleared out camps and made residents move. When you push people around like that, they have to pick up what they can. And they have to take it away where they go to. And you see them hurt and cry because they lose something. I don't think that's right. But he says what happened Thursday was a good thing, a cleaning up of the underpass on Jackson Street. I think it was healthy. I think it was needed. And I, I'm personally glad that we're, we're where we're at now. Outreach groups partner with the city for the cleanup to make sure everyone is treated with respect and dignity. They're following CDC shelter in place guidelines. So instead of removing camps, residents had to move their belongings, but will be welcomed back. Most people are, are pretty understanding uh, when it's explained that, look, we just want to clean it up so you don't have to sleep in filth. Um, we, want to, we want to take care of you. In the past, the city and outreach groups have not always worked together like this, but they say they've come a long way towards keeping the houseless community stabilized and safe. And I think this could be a model moving forward. Residents of the encampments here on Jackson Street are going to be able to move back once the pavement dries. For WHAS 11 News, I'm Rose McBride.